let's start off with, do you, do you believe in God? Yes, I do. Okay. And, um, let's see. What do you believe by um, I'm a Muslim, so I believe that there's one God, and that God sent out messengers who spread the word of God, and well, He made us, and we are because of Him. He is all-knowing. Uh, God is the all-knowing, He is the all-powerful, and well, we live by Him. Everything happens because of Him. Okay. Um. Why, why do you think God made man? Um, God made man to worship him and uh, God put him in, in a test through life. Uh, he's here as a test. Um, everything you do, uh, it, it's, it's basically a test of whether you're gonna, whether you're gonna turn to him or whether you're gonna turn to uh, everything else here on earth. Um, because in the end there is a heaven and there's a hell, I believe in the year after and um, well whatever we do in this world uh, is basically a test of whether we're gonna whether we're gonna be positive and move forward or whether we we're gonna just stay back and move towards the arms of this world okay um. Maybe you can ask this uh, personally, or or not. Um, but how do you have a relationship with God? How do you um, become close to God? Well, I pray to God. Um, the funny thing about humans is that most of the time we turn to God only when we need. However, I turn to God. I try and turn to God um, most of the time. I try to turn to God and speak to God daily. I try and pray to Him. As a Muslim, we have five daily prayers, and in that five daily prayers, we turn to God. Also, Islam is a way of life, so you turn to God in, in the simple things that you do. You pray to Him in the, for example, going to bed. You, you make sure prayer to God that you wake up and that um, if, you, if you die, um, well, you know, you're going to die in a good state. Um, it's the simple things that you do every day. Um, for example, not hurting other people, not um, not harming others, not harming animals, not help, harming other creations of God. In that way, you're turning to God in the simple things that you do in every way, in every day. And that's mainly because that's the way that I've been brought up and because uh, the, my religion is basically a way of life. Um, I guess a couple more. Um, why do you think people turn away from God? What do you think would be a big reason? Well, people turn away from God because they, they don't have their trust in God, they don't have their faith in God, and they, they uh, people go through through hardships, and they, they actually blame these hardships on God, where He's just putting you through a test. Okay. Um, there have been times, there have been times in my life where, where I've where I've, although I, although I have faith in God, I've, I've, I've said, oh, you know, why did this happen to me? Why did that happen to me? But in the end, I've realized that um, it's all a test from God. And well, if you, if you just turn away from Him, you're not going to be helped. You, you're just turning towards uh, like falseness, and like you know, you're turning towards something that's not real. But uh, God is real, so I mean, why not turn to Him? He's the only one that can help you. Sure. So, so, okay. uh, how can you be sure like, about how can anybody be sure about what can someone be um, uh, like how can they be certain what they believe is the truth well uh, in the end whatever is whatever is logical whatever you think whatever you, the way that you've been brought up I think that that determines like how faithful you are and that makes you believe more in uh, what's uh, what's and it makes it seem more real to you so obviously um, I think that's it okay.